everybody welcome back to the channel Nate here go carts are gone fishing back at you with another Vichia um, I got some parts from go power sports I got my inch and a quarter flanges bearings and I just got back I spent the whole morning working with my friend at the machine shop got my inch and a quarter keyed shaft now and I got my new uh, weld on hangers and I didn't know this but evidently the inch and a quarter are bigger than a one inch I got me it makes sense so I'm thinking about just welding it level because I don't want to have to take this pipe off and rebend it I'm just gonna weld it level onto the edge here cut this one off and shorten this pipe one reason because I'm worried about my chain length being too long I'm already gonna have to put a chain tensioner in it <clears throat> and uh, that'll shorten it up a good six inches and won't make my chain as long uh, go power sports sent me a six sticker cool good power sports sticker shout out to them thanks guys but I also need to remove this exhaust I'm gonna have to build something because it's not letting the engine sit flat in there and I have to mark my holes so I can mount that engine so I gotta mount the engine I gotta weld those on there, cut off the old ones, and also I went to tractor supply. And I ain't too thrilled about it, but this is the look I was going for. Um, this is a tubeless tire, so it's solid. I don't know if I like it. Um, it was thirty-five dollars too, super expensive. So I don't know if it's gonna stay on there. I'm gonna keep my eyes peeled for something else. But it, that's the look I want with the tire on the back. So, all right, let's see what I can get done today. It's Saturday, about 2, 3 o'clock. And uh, I got a lot of work to do to get this thing, hopefully to a rolling chassis, if not trying to ride it by this video. So, stay tuned, guys. <laughs> it is the next day and uh me and my buddy kind of mocked up this back wheel last night and i got the clutch sitting up there it's not quite lined up yet i gotta move that sprocket over a little more but i got a few things i gotta do today i mean i might be able to get a ride in i might not we'll see I'm trying but this wheel is not gonna stay on here uh, my buddy's talked me out of it because it's a solid wheel, no, no air and, you know, no tube in it or anything. And they, they have a really good point. You know, if I get up speed and this wheel starts getting hot, it might just flop right off of that rim. So that's going back to tractor supply. And uh, there's my one inch clutch. I'm not sure what the gear ratio is yet. I haven't counted any teeth. 
but my goal for today is to get the motor actually mounted and get everything welded down solid and get that axle in there solid and if I could do that I might can throw a chain on it and give it a little test ride so I think I'm gonna get to work first on mounting the motor I'm gonna do that first Try it. 